The biggest issue that we have now has, has been that that we have had for the last over 40 years. Since I started, uh, I started in the first narcotics task force we had in 1981. And honestly, it just seems that it, it's just gotten worse with the drug problem. And with the drug problem, there comes burglaries, there comes the thefts, you know, there comes the other violent type crime. And so we have to, we have to do a better job of, of working, you know, against that tide of drugs coming into our community. And we also have to work on the front and the back end with uh, rehab resources and, and bringing our community resources together to help, to help from that angle, not just a law enforcement problem. People not knowing our deputies, who our deputies are. I think that the people want to know who is protecting them in the parish. Uh, our deputies are just, they're not getting out in the public anymore. They're, they're, they're driving around doing patrol and and that's pretty much, you know, they're not interacting with the public. And I, I want to see that more. I hear that from our people in the parish that would like to see that. Again, the drug problem, uh, the drugs, drug problem fuels everything. Um, it fuels your thefts, your burglaries, uh, on up to your domestic violence. A lot of that is, um, has to do with substance abuse or financial problems caused by substance abuse. Um, litter. We have a huge litter problem. Uh, we've worked on that in different areas. This summer I actually uh, used school resource officers during the school year. They're tied up and in the summertime they have free time and we uh, utilize some of them in a uh, undercover type manner working on litter problems and enforcing those litter laws. Uh, that's two of the main things that, that plague us over there.